My name is Anushka Savgar and I'm a Bharatanatyam dancer. I've been dancing for about 12 years and I'm performing Kalinga Nartanam, which is a dance that's based on the painting Defeat of Kaliya that was created around the 17th century. Krishna set out to play along the banks of the Yamuna River. But when he reached there, he saw that all his friends and the cows had fainted. As he revived them, Krishna learned that there was Kalinga, the great five-headed snake, and he was polluting the river. Krishna dived into the water and searched for the snake. Upon seeing Krishna, Kalinga grew very angry and annoyed. Krishna taunted and played with the snake, but Kalinga attacked, coiling around Krishna until he was trapped. Krishna escaped the clutches of Kalinga and danced on top of its head, performing the Kalinga Narthanam and subdued it. Kalinga's venom spewed out and Krishna emerged victorious with Kalinga and his wives surrendering to Krishna.
Namaste. My name is Suman Nayak, and I'm the artistic director of Natasha School of Bharatanatyam. For my performance today, I'll be doing a dance based on the painting Krishna and Radha seated in the bower. This dance highlights the sweet romantic moments of Radha with her beloved Krishna. In this, Radha walks into a lush garden filled with beautiful flower beds and jasmine vines. As she enjoys the cool breeze, she longs to be with her Krishna. She searches around for him and finds him mischievously hiding behind the bushes. She beckons to him, Krishna, Come, let's go to the beautiful garden of Brindavanam. Come with me. Look at the beautiful Yamuna River. How about we dive in and play in the waters together? Krishna, do you hear the cuckoos singing? What do you think they're saying? I think they're saying that you and I should be together. As Krishna mischievously disappears and reappears, she says, how could you leave me when I have given myself to you? Now come, let's go to the garden of Vrindavan. Hari Prabhu, 
Tell me, tell me,